never survive the re battle were it not for the intervention of this ragtag team we know as the Guardians of the Galaxy. To uncover the true story, I spoke with the captain of the crew. Peter Quill, thank you for joining me today. The leader of your group was telling me about the plan to save Xandar from the Rogue Creed. Wait, did you say the leader? I'm the leader. Wait, who said that? It was Rocket. <laughs> well, don't believe anything Rocket says. But he said it was your plan. Well, okay. You can't believe that. It was 12% of a plan. Maybe. But it's really key Well, go on, introduce yourselves. Have you forgotten who I am? This place is so fragile. This is none other than Drax the Destroyer. See? I mean, she knows who I am. Anyways, I danced circles around the Kree dude. Told him to save the day. Your weird and embarrassing dance is a means of distraction so that the rockets could destroy the Kree's weapon. Thank you, Drax, for setting the record straight for our viewers. You're welcome. What courage, Peter Quill. To flail around like a total fool to help save the day. Don't case it. You're not really making it sound as intense and dangerous as it actually was. I'm sure it was very intense. We'll learn more about just how intense and dangerous. dangerous it was in just a moment. Our world would have been destroyed in the battle with the Kree were it not for the help we received from the Guardians of the Galaxy. I was fortunate to secure this exclusive interview with them. I am absolutely thrilled to speak with the leader of the Guardians of the Galaxy. Yeah, I'm the leader. And I'm also the captain. Captain Leader. I thought the leader was Star-Lord. Nah, we only let him think that. But don't call him Star-Lord. His close friends call him Peter J. Quill. Noted, well, thank you. So, it was your idea to help save him? More or less. I am Groot. Okay, okay. It wasn't exactly my idea. Is this the famous Groot? <laughs> Every Zandarian knows how he gave your life to save the rest of the Guardians that day of the battle. Tell us in your own words how that felt. I am Groot. You gotta forgive him. He's got what you call a limited vocabulary. What he's trying to say is, he did sacrifice himself to save us all, and Zando. Fortunately, he's plant-based, so he grew him back. And they grow up so fast, especially when you water them. And it would appear so. So back to my original question, whose idea was it to save Zandar? It was Quills. He had this half-baked plan, and we saved his butt and his story. I am Groot! Okay, it was three quarters baked. But we were all heroes that day. I am Groot. I'll be back with more of the Guardians in a moment. Xandar was nearly destroyed by a rogue Kree who chose not to honor our peace treaty. Without the Nova Corps forces and unusual allies like the Ravagers and the Guardians of the Galaxy, we would never have survived. To discover more about these allies, let's return to my exclusive interview with the Guardians. It's not often one gets to interview the most dangerous woman in the galaxy. Welcome, Gamora. Wait, who called me that? Peter Quill. You mean Star Wars? Oh, I was told he hates that. Oh, yeah, he does. He really hates it. So how did you Guardians end up teaming up with the Ravagers? They normally only work for themselves. Well, uh... Oh, we liked them. And was that part of Peter Quill's plan? You mean the plan that didn't go according to plan? We were completely out In the end, though, we were able to defeat the Rogue Creek. But we couldn't have done it without Quill. That's right. And here he is now, Peter Quill. What did you have to say about this? Um, you know, I guess, I mean, it was really a group effort to execute my plan. Thank you, Gamora. I'm always happy if you told me to. 
that I would love to hear more about how Tara was chosen for this Wonders of Xandar tour. Well, that was totally my idea. And that car, too, because I love that place. It's awesome. I was there as a kid, and I, I, I mean, I cannot wait to get to go back and ride Horizons. Also want to see the energy, dinosaurs, and, of course, hear the veggie veggie fruit fruit. That is the best. <laughs> okay, well, I'm sure it will be wonderful for you to relive all of those memories again. And it's thanks to the Guardians that Xandar is reaching out to other cultures across the galaxy.